Guys, it's happening. We're going on to Dover. We have told Jennifer Joe Corncomp to fuck off, and we're hopping in the tent truck. And hopefully, ah, oh, top. See, Jennifer Joe Corncomp's more realistic. A top twenty-five finish. I feel like if I could finish top twenty-two in Atlanta, I could finish top twenty-five in this stupid truck. So let's take a look at the point standings for the truck series. Johnny Sauter, your points leader with one win. Stuart Friesen with a win. Austin Wayne Self with a win. Justin Fontaine. And what, has there not been a truck series race since the last time we run? No, no, actually there has not. Well, shout out to the truck series and they're like month long breaks. That's, well, that's really about the only thing I can show you really. So we'll go ahead and uh, yeah, we'll hop into it. Oh yeah, look at that sexy beast. Look at that sexy beast. Well, here we go to qualify. Oh boy, it's gonna be a frustrating race, I can tell you that. So assuming the AI still kind of drive the way AI do, which which we know how they drive. We know how they drive, and they're gonna drive the same way here at Dover. Where if you slide up just a little bit, kind of like you do at Dover, I mean that's pretty much the best way to be quick here at Dover is kind of diamond it, uh, like like a like Richmond or Martinsville, where you kind of enter flat, you, you drift up a little bit, and then get kind of a straight launch off the corner. That's how I always run Dover to be quick. I mean people have got different ways to run it, but that's how I run it. And the AI would just like to squeeze your little nose in there. So we'll see how it goes, but yeah, that's like right there, that mount we slid up right there, that's just enough for those guys to squeeze it off in there. So it's, gonna piss, it's gonna piss me off, I guarantee it. But I don't I don't think our speed is that bad. But I honestly I really have no idea. We'll probably qualify second to last year. Because that didn't feel good whatsoever. I don't know. That's just does not have a lot of anything in it. Oh, 26, that's not bad. That's where we qualified the first time, right? We gotta finish 25th, so I mean if we can qualify there, uh, I think we'll be okay. I, I don't know. It's just pff, I don't know. Like I can't make it loose without it just totally being loose. Once again, another issue with NASCAR Heat 2 and NASCAR Heat Evolution. You can't find adjust, you can't just make it a smidge looser. You either just like you try to make it a little looser and it goes way loose, or you, you leave it with what I have and it's just like a, like a brick. So I don't know. Let's hop into it. Alrighty, the Jigs 200 at Dover. Oh boy. Joe Nemechek looks a bit slow today. Oh really, does he now? Todd Gillen's car is really fast today. Oh really? And then there we are. <laughs> oh man, well that's thought it'd be fun. All right, fellow scrubs, how you doing? It's good to see you again. Back in an even worse truck. I didn't think that could happen. Oh, what's up, Robbie? Yeah, let's get it going, Robbie. And we're not going anywhere. All right, well, we got a 10-lap first stage. There we go, we'll finally hit fourth. And we're going to go to the back. We do that one and two thing where we just, like, we were on his ass there, and then we just hit the corner, and it's just, nah. Even though we're still full throttle. Oh boy, I'm already back to 28th, and there's gonna be the rest of the spots because we're not fast up here, obviously. Oh well, the one the one truck might give us a break here. I don't know. We might be faster than him. Whoever the hell that is, I still don't know who the who the hell. Who, uh, Jay, Jamie Mosley. Can somebody tell me who Jamie Mosley is? I sort of got never heard that name in my life. I don't think I have. I could be wrong, but I don't know, man. There you go. Ooh, get your ass cop old boot. Another another problem I have. I did it in practice and it pissed me off, but it's still kind of an issue. Alright, so you know when you hit the apron, obviously race cars don't like when you hit the apron. We don't have when you have that transition. And I understand there being a penalty. I encourage there being a penalty. But not when you just barely clip it and the car just goes from straight to no loose. I hate that. I hate it, because it's not realistic. When have you ever seen anybody clip the apron and the thing just like snaps right around just like that? I mean, maybe it's some extreme circumstances, but it doesn't happen. Dover's a Dover's a track where it's like the transition to apron to track is not really all that big. Like it's it's pretty easy to clip, and there's a lot of tracks out there, like Atlanta. Atlanta is one of those tracks, especially in the Cup Series, where you see guys like Kevin Harvick, who's argu arguably the best at, at Atlanta, where he pretty much like rides right on top of that transition, right there on that white line where the apron is. It doesn't affect him any, but you know, it is what it is. Point point being is that it, it shouldn't fuck you over like it does in this game. I just hit it right there. That wasn't too bad. But like, there's just chances. There's just like spots where you just smack the transition there and it just forces you right around like it shouldn't. And Dover's always been one of those tracks in this game. <sighs> That's okay. All right, 29th. This, 
Oh, this is nice. Five to go. Oh, yeah, I got it. Yeah, give me a minute. I'll get right up to the lead here in a second. Oh, man, listen to that tire screech. That tire screech is rough. That's a rough sound. Oh, yeah, here you go. Oh, somebody's blowing up. And we're wrecking anyways. No point that stage. And we're back to full. <laughs> Ah, uh, ping, pingity pong, pongity ping. I try to move over a little bit. What happens? It just pongs me right around, man. You can't touch anybody still. I thought they were going to fix that. I thought that was going to be like it. It might feel a little bit better, but not much. That's like two hot seat races, and I've already ponged right around twice. I'm tired of ponging, man. I'm going to go ahead and pit. Everybody else is pitting, except for Bailey Curry. I guess that's the one that blew up, huh? Alrighty, well, I made a couple adjustments. Ooh, 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 what the hell? The leaderboard changed there. Travis Quample just okay, went down a couple Park, of spots. What the Are you ready? That was weird. I'm not sure what happened there. Anyways, I put a little bit more tape on it. Get a little bit more out of it. Oh, yeah. Barbecue in the pits! Yeah, look at this restart. Jesus. Well, that, that was nice. Too bad we're going to lose it all right here. Well, at least we made it to the bottom. We won't lose it quite as bad. Hopefully I didn't loosen it up too much. I'm afraid I did, but I don't think I did. I might have. Now look at Justin Fontaine. Didn't you just win? What the hell are you doing back here? You realize you actually suck? Oh, yeah, it's definitely a little bit looser. Um, the only adjustment I really made was tape and a little bit down on the left front air pressure, but... It's, it's scorching, I'll tell you that. Definitely feels a little bit more competitive, I think. Robbie, you mind if I, uh, uh, okay, you got a chance. What the hell does that say? Java? Java Chews? What the hell is a Java Chew? JavaChews.com. I'm gonna have to Google that. Hmm. Well, I can beat him in the center of the corner. I just can't beat them on the straight straight away. Same shit, different track. So I'm just gonna have to send it, really. Or just move them up out of the way. I mean, I don't want to wreck them, but I I like to think I could move them, but I don't know. These trucks are such blocks. Well, here we go. We'll get Jordan Anderson here. I'm gonna slide up into him, but we'll get him. There you go. That's the easiest way to pass it over. Just let an AI car get trapped on the. Oh, excuse me. Oh, there we go. Oh, no, I'm still here. We're okay. Right, careful now. Still there. I just hate how much like momentum I lose because of that. I didn't really get out of shape. I just hit him. <laughs> like, you can still hit people without losing a lot of speed. I'm pretty sure. All right, well, we made it in the top 25. Can we get rain now? I'd be okay with some rain. I'm really not too... Somebody's dicking up the line up here. Who is it? Is that Clay Greenfield up there? Hey, buddy, move out the way, champ. You're holding up everybody back here. <laughs> And who is the bonehead not passing him? Come on, buddy. You're killing us. You must have the same problem. Fast in the corners, not fast on the straightaways. Oh, that's scorching. God. That's going to give me a headache. I'm not going to be able to play more than like two episodes or two races of video or like a, in a sitting. It's just going to give me a headache. That's such a horrible scorching sound. Hold your line. Stay up high. Like nails on a chalkboard, man. Uh, I just can't get there. Here comes big time Jordan Anderson back. I got oh, and here he comes. Here he comes Poke. Yep, get up. Yeah, he just drives it straight off, like straight off the corner. Doesn't sign up to the wall or anything. Oh, I, I just, I just bugs the shit out of me, dude. Like that just should not work ever. He should not be able to carry enough speed straight off the corner. When I'm talking straight off the corner, I'm talking. He doesn't like really lose. He doesn't leave the apron. Like that's how you go fast IRL. You use up all the track when you come off of turn four, especially in like all the top series. You're gonna see everybody come straight up off and, and get next to this wall right here. Cause that's how you carry the most speed. You don't carry speed by coming off the corner that straight. You just scrub all your speed if you're to do that in real life. Either that or you, you'd be going too quick and you wouldn't be able to stick it anyways. But that's okay. Jordan Anderson just nah. Obviously Jordan Anderson would be able to stick it. It's just like, like stuff like that, man. It just it just pisses me off because it's like it's like such a little thing. But that's like the difference between a lot of spots, really, honestly. Like if I'm riding faster, like that's just an a one of those AI things where they just play on different rules because I can never stick that. 
You've watched this whole video. When have I ever just like pulled it underneath somebody? Because it's not how it works for me. Simple little things like that with the AI, man. <sighs> Killing me. All right, well, we... Okay. Uh, we went from 29th to 28th. Why is the leaderboard changing? Right, I, don't know. I don't know why that's changing there, but... We're back on the outside. Jeez, what do we have a... <laughs> do we have <laughs> that one dude on Corn Cobb's crew that doesn't... That can't, like, put the jack down? Oh, my God. Why do we get such good restarts? Why can't we trade off some of that for some straightaway speed or something? Okay, that didn't pong me quite as bad, so I appreciate that, but still. I still lose all my speed anyways. God. Running back here behind fucking Mosley. At least we'll get big time Joe. What's up, front row? Oh, man. It's just like... <sighs> all right. Well, 25 laps. At least we're going to have to make a pit stop, probably. We can't go this last run without pitting once. So, I mean, there's that. That's cool, I guess. No, no, no. See, no no regard, man. It's done. Fuck it. No, I want my caution. There you go. I'm sorry, Joe. I'm sorry you had to be the guy, but thank you. That took a, that took a while there, NASCAR. Oh, man. Like, I realized I did, you know, what the AI cars usually did do and, like, throw it in there, but... Unfortunately, that's the way I got to do it, but he still doesn't give a shit like he still sees me send it and just oh I'm just gonna come on in there and force him on the apron and wreck both of us <laughs> Like just no awareness man. Just no awareness you play any other racing game If you if you if you pull off a move like that They'll get the fuck out of the way unless you're your, your, like rival or something And then, yeah, they probably won't give you an inch But most people will just get the hell out of the way because they don't want to tear up their, their car, but <sighs> We're gonna pit man four tires and fuel All right, well, we lost one spot <laughs> At least we could top it off, man. I don't know what the fuel run is. I would imagine still not. We're not close enough to the fuel window still, so. Damn it. If I could stop restarting up here. Oh, 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 oh. There's a hole. Hey. And we're still four laps short. Oh, man. That was almost in there. Hey, we're P25 right here. Not bad. And we, we're going to have, like, a lap fresher tires. That's not going to mean much, but it might mean something. I don't know. All right, well, all we gotta do. What did I say? What what the fuck did I say before this race? Mm, that pisses me off, man. That pisses me off. And there's that fucking. I'll take my caution. Thank you. I didn't have to actually spin it all the way around. Oh, look, oh, we got some people pitting back here, all right. And that's it. <laughs> well, now we might be able to make it on fuel, I don't know, you think? <sighs> oh, I hate that, man. I hate that. I can't stick it, because I'm not an AI car, and they just poke their little nose off in there. <sighs> Going up the gut. Going up the gut. Oh, sorry, Jordan. Thought I could fit it. Oh, we're so close on fuel. Well, I'm dead. Nah, the hell with it. I'm going. I'm not pitting again. We're close enough. It just went down to 16 right there. What the fuck, dude? Pong. I got ponged. Caution. Fucking damn it, man. Fuck. That shouldn't have happened. We could have pulled some fuel strategy. But because of that shit, he just doors me and I lose my whole truck. Why? Because I pong. Three years, NASCAR heat. Oh, my God. I'm sorry, but I, I just can't. I can't. It's just so frustrating. I'm just... It's so frustrating because all the races I've done, like, this, I thought this was going to be the year. This is going to be the year where things are really going to turn around for these games, and I'm still fucking ponging. I'm still fucking ponging. I shouldn't be ponging. I'm not pitting. I'm not pitting. I'm staying out here. I'm going to get my ass run over, but I'm not pitting. I'm good on fuel. To hell with it. I've had enough, man. Why is Tanner Thorson up here? All right. Come to the green. <laughs> be ready here. Ah, oh, man. All right, well, here we go. At least we can use our good restarts. Oh, nice. I got radiator damage. I hit I hit my driver's side door, but I got radiator damage, I guess. Ah, oh, man. Sure is great to have great restarts. All right, well, now's the time for the rain to happen, I guess. Rain, please. 
Look how fast they catch me. Jesus H. Christ. I'm gonna hold the bottom as best I can, so. You might wanna. Don't you dare try to take me. Wanna get underneath me down there. I ain't going 3 wide. Mm -mm, it ain't happening. This, this is fun. Shout out to my man Todd back here. <laughs> I'm gonna take him to the back with me. Oh man, this car is so bad. This truck is so bad. All I gotta do is get a top 25, man. All I gotta do is get a top 25. We'll be all right. We'll be all right. 11 laps to go. I don't even think I can hold on to a top 25 in that amount of time, but we'll try. Boy, I can't wait to start my own team. Oh, I'm gonna shove too much. No, 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 you fucker. No. I said no. If you wanna pass me, pass me around the high side like everybody else is doing. Alright? I'm not gonna be. I'm not. For fuck's sake! Why? Second time! Why? Why does that happen? Oh my god, man. Three wide, I'm going straight, and I just, like, I don't even get a chance to save it. God. I'm pitting. Ten spots lost. We're back to 30th. We gotta get five spots in less than ten laps, I think. <laughs> I'm trying. Alright, here we go. Good restart. We're gonna get forced in the wall. Just about. At least he backed out of it, though. That's cool. <laughs> block, man. What a block. And there he is. That was my only chance, man. That was my only chance. So I guess I still could force it in and get two more spots, but I don't think it's going to happen. I really don't. I'll try to make this thing a little bit looser. I just don't understand, man. There's just like, it's a terrible feeling. There's just no nose in it. Like, the nose doesn't turn. Uh, it feels like the nose is kind of like digging into the track. Honestly, I, it's just like, well, I didn't really mean to do that, but no, that's all right. That's okay. That's my fault. <laughs> I looked over to make sure I was still recording. Well, we're not going to catch any of these bastards back, but. Yeah, four laps to go. I might be able to catch one or two of these guys. I don't think I would have had enough for a top 25 anyways, especially not at Dover. This track just sucks for the AI, just the way they race around here, because once again, it just highlights how, how they play on just special rules and how they're able to stick things that you just normally wouldn't be able to stick. And it really makes it worse when you're that slow, because when you're this slow, you have to bank on every little inch of everything going perfect for you to get a spot or for you to get and finish where you need to finish, right? When you're just as fast as everybody else, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. But when you're this slow and you got to you know, you gotta scratch and claw your way to where you need to be. Every little thing matters, and everything little, every little thing that's wrong bugs you because half of the shit shouldn't be in the game, but it is, and it's frustrating, and it hurts your performance with the AI. So that's that's my biggest deal, man. I don't know. It's just tough. It's just frustrating. That's all it is. It's just frustrating because once again, I've, I've played these games hard since NASCAR Heat Evolution, and I just still feel like I'm. I've been gypped out of some stuff that should have been fixed a long time ago. I don't know. But, um, one to go. One to go. <laughs> Might be able to get one of these two. Uh, I don't know. Justin Fontaine from winning to sucking. Can you give him the boot? How did I know that just wouldn't do anything? Uh, 29. At least I got a top 30. Here we did finish. Should have been better. Should have been better on a different couple scenarios there, but who the hell knows? Maybe we, we maybe could have won the damn race if it would have played out. Fuel strategy would have played out, but it's whatever, man. Well, look at the finishing results. Bailey Curry broke. T Tanner Thorson won. I don't need to check second. Todd Gillen won a stage and then sucked. Uh, look at the rest of it there. So, not, not a great race. Unfortunately, we're uh, not going to get an offer from Jennifer Joe Corncob because I couldn't get a top 25. That was the last time Corncob ever finished top 25 in a race.
<laughs> but don't feel bad. Dover's a tough track. Yeah. And I just don't get any money. <laughs> Whole bunch of horse shit. Well, anyways, there you have it. Unfortunately, not the result we wanted. <sighs> Definitely could have finished better, but uh, Dover sucks. So hopefully we don't go to Dover next. But yeah, there you have it. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Do me a favor. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed. But that'll do it. On to the next Truck Series Hot Seat. We'll see you there.